So I'm trying to get them to bond by doing a team building exercise. I'm not gonna lie, it's a struggle. But I'm trying to look on the positive side of things. We just started doing this experiment. So it shouldn't be hard, you know, this soon, right? Kevin, I'm really glad you're actually contributing for like once. Shit, she don't even know. Four times. Yeah, yeah, well that's fine. That's how House of Cards work. Um, slice? Um, don't call me that. Um, slice? I, okay, I like that you think you're funny and sassy, but you really aren't at all. Like, to just like, further there. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't I think so. Piece of homie. Okay, Logan, you literally haven't done anything in this, this house. Homie. So, just... Yeah, Logan, can you at least try? At least I'm trying. Not succeeding, yeah, but he's do, trying. Do, so, do something, Logan. Oh! Logan! Logan! It was her! Oh, yeah, blame it on me, Logan. Blame it on me. Wrong here? Um, no, I did everything right, so. You guys need to communicate with each other. We did communicate. I told Logan not to mess it all up like he messed up. Positively. You, you didn't communicate positively. Yeah. I'll tell you something. I knocked it over. I just find it really funny when people get mad at Logan, so. Um, let's just wrap it up for the day. Good work, guys. Let's see you tomorrow. No strengths and weaknesses can be chosen. I know your weakness. Try hard. Okay, so just to explain this project a little bit better, for our psych final, we had to, well, we got to do anything as long as it was a psych experiment. So in my experiment, we are showing how contrasting personalities can work together towards a greater goal. And so I'm trying to prove to my teachers and my peers that this is possible, and that's my thesis. Oh, and uh, Jordan, of course, her final project is just to do a documentary for her video class, so we just decided to do both together, so we're doing them at the same time. Thanks. Don't drop it though, it's fragile. Okay. Got it. Got it. I'm so sorry. That's I'm. I'm so about how different personalities can work together towards a common goal. You're taking a whole bunch of people who shouldn't work together and making them work together? Yeah. But it's actually, you know, it's going really great. Um, thanks for asking. That's good. <laughs> yeah. So what's your, what's your psych experiment about? <laughs> oh, um, I'm studying how music affects our studying habits. Wow, that's original. Yeah, well, it's, we're, little, we're, it's uh, challenging. Yeah, well, we're graded on a curve, so I guess we'll see who really does better. Yeah, 
We will. Um, break a leg. Good one. So, obviously, due to some things that happened last day, we can no longer do that fun thing that I wanted to do with 26 eggs, which are now broken. I guess it just wasn't in the cards. Oh, it's a little rushed. Bad joke. Yeah. Okay, um, so just improvising here. No more <laughs> fragile things. We are going to play Countdown. So basically, what you want to do in this game is just count as high as possible in the One, group. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, In the group, right? Okay, but wouldn't that be count up if you're counting up? Then it, it, it's called count up, okay? Right. Good point. All right. Okay, so basically your goal is to count as high as you can as possible with the group. And you can only say one number at a time. You can't interrupt each other. If you both say the same number at the same time, you have to start all over again. Right? You just try to count as high as possible. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. No, six, you, you can't. Six. Yeah, you can't do that. Okay, what? Like, why can't I just count up on my Because own? you have to trust I think your the whole team point is that it's supposed to go like I'm sorry, are you running this game? You have to trust your group members, basically. Okay? So, you, if there's a big pause, it doesn't matter how long the pause is, but you can't interrupt each other. You can't say the same numbers, like, at the same time or anything like that. Okay? Alright. Alright. Wait, but how do we know who starts? You just feel the you just feel the room, okay? okay. Doesn't matter Five. who starts. One. 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 Are you kidding me, guys? She just said that if there is a specific order of people. There doesn't have to be all of us go at once. One person starts and the rest of us go. Do you not listen? Okay, are you listening to yourself right now? Like, you were part of that. Everybody said one, including you. Because she thinks she's better than everybody else. What? No! I'm just a natural born leader. I can't help that I'm not a follower, okay? It was natural and it made sense for me to start. Okay, why don't you just start again? Just do it again. Okay, let's try. It's not my fault. You know, I'm a natural born leader too. I was captain of the rugby team. Nobody cares about rugby, you dip! You have no idea what it's like to live in the real world. And you know about the real world, Logan? Literally, Logan, you run a scooter gang called the Scoot Scoots. And it's a bunch of 13-year-olds who are running away from home because their Xbox Live membership expired. That is none of your guys' business. <sighs> Riley. Two. Three. One. Yo, why are you saying one I again? I don't... I, when do we start? We already did start. We were getting up to three. One. Two. Three. Four. One. 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 No. No. I said one. Two. That's two. Thank you. Sixteen. Ten. Okay, well. ten. One. No. We're not playing that anymore. What? Why not? Actually, we're just not. Well, and we could play if you would say two. Riley has been gone for a while, guys. I don't... You think she's okay? I mean, she probably got really intimidated by Logan and the Scoot Scoots. Hey, leave him alone, all right? Are you kidding me? Bickering's probably why she left in the first place. Um, uh, why don't we check out her, uh, notebook to see if she has any other exercises for us? That's actually a really good idea. There's tons of group exercises in there, and I think we only have to show one example of real-life cooperation. The rest is just research. So, then what's in it? Uh, trust fall? Okay, so, on behalf of everyone here, we just want to say we're sorry. We know we were pretty hard to work with last day. Yeah, just a bit. Well, uh, we actually got some stuff done while you were out doing whatever. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> we were working on our trust walls. Oh, did you get them from my binder? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, my... <laughs> <laughs> 
It was an accident. I'm sorry. It was an accident. They really came together to complete a common objective. And they did it all by themselves. They didn't need my help with complicated scenarios or exercises. They just needed a, a common goal that they all thought was worth overlooking their differences for. Which just happened to be helping me with my project, which, you know, was a bonus. You know, I'm really glad I did this project. Okay, okay, let's go. Let's go. Three, two, one. Oh, Logan, one. you dropped your dignity. What? <gasps> They don't know what's coming. <laughs> Discuss the extent to which findings can be generalized from a single case study. But the question is, what is a case study? Because if we are conducting a case study, then I want to know what a case study is. Thanks for your, you know, appreciation, but... I know, but I'm a part of this. Informed consent. Informed consent is a thing. I know this. I've researched a little bit of psychology. I took a course in high school. I know what informed consent is, and I need it. 